We're back on the Vicky show. And my lighting is not correctly right. I need that one. Can you close that window, please? Like, the thing. You know, they be still a new show, you guys. Am I supposed to look right at it? Yeah, just look right at it. Alright, so take a little bit of and come out. She came all the way from Philly. Like, this is my sister. You also know this. If you, just because you don't see me with fam, we had a lot of time together, didn't we, sis? Everywhere. 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 She's a traveling diva. So, anyway, Feminine is here. Um, Feminine, I just, basically, Feminine, I want to know about how long you've been in the scene for your fans or people who just want to know, how long you've been in the scene for? Five years. February made five years since the first time I walked the mini ball or whatever, because I'm the mini ball diva, so they say. So they say. Mm -hmm. what, what is your favorite mini ball? Like, you know, like, the Philly one, DC, New York, like, Estos, or like, uh, First Friday, what is your favorite? Do you have a favorite? I love Philly. I love my BC. And I love Baltimore. I I like my, that's my life. Sorry, I had to get a light <laughs> for the blunt. You know, I smoked down. Me too. Now, well, I love Baltimore. We, I love buns and all them crazy was you, you, you wasn't in Baltimore over the weekend. What's the boy? I went. I didn't go. I was in Philly for gay pride. For gay pride? Yeah. Oh, how was gay pride? It was all right. Now, family, you was in you was in Revlon. I oh, come on at Prestige, at Ebony. Come on and Mizza. Well, you are currently in Mizza. What happened between those houses? Let's go from Revlon. My co is actually in Revlon as well. Shout Hi, out Revlon. to him. Now, why did you leave the house? Like, what happened? They didn't. They didn't see my performance. They kicked you out? out? No, 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 no. Oh. I left, but they were giving me a hair stuff about my performance, and it wasn't all the way together because I was just starting out, mm -hmm. and they just didn't give me what I want, so I left and I wanted to make them know it and make them know that I could walk that category that they really didn't see me for. Oh, so basically, the come on, I mean, the Revlon did not see a performance like mm -hmm. that. Like for, oh, okay, okay, okay. Now, you was a come on. I was a come on back in the day. I, I, don't, I, think, know. I don't know if you was in the Yeah. But we had this discussion. Right, so why did you leave? What happened with Cass to come on? It's just, I was by myself. I felt like I was the Philadelphia House of Cabron, like, a little bit. Um, besides, well, what you trying to say? Besides, besides, wasn't... besides John. Okay. Rest in peace, John. Hill, Rest in peace. Together, but I love the John. You know the new kids in my generation? It's like the performance and all the stuff that really, really counts that make it more hot. And I was just all by myself. Mm -hmm. I really felt all by myself as a girl. Okay. Now you went from Ebony. Katrina's an Ebony. What's the shade? Is there any tea with you on her? With me and Katrina? Yeah. Speaking why of Ebony. Why would you say that, though? It was rumor circulating. Mm -hmm. You know I get to all my tea. Mm -hmm. So, is there any shade? Katrina. She actually the friend to the show. Shout out to Katrina. Katrina is my best friend. Like, one of my best friends in the whole wide world. We're oh. girls, and we've been through our shit. But I love and live for Katrina, so obviously. Now, it's circulating that she might be on your team for Sunday. Is that true? Uh, of course. I'm not even going to be phony. I'm trying. I'm trying to get to her on. Her. I'm trying to make her, but I do have other things going on. But I'm trying to get her. And even if she says she's going to, Katrina be that bitch that just won't do it at the last minute. So you never ever know what goes on with my little sister. But speaking of Katrina, what happened in Philadelphia when Katrina came out in Philly and you came out? I don't know if it's Philly or Boys when something happened. She came out, then Erica King got in it. And she, Katrina pushed Erica, then you got in it, and you and Erica started tearing it. Tearing it means fighting for people from LA and people don't know who about the show don't know. Tearing it means you know like I I think LA I say, I, it's a word I say. I, I forgot I haven't been there so long. But anyway, you and Erica tore it. What happened? That whole situation. It was liquor. It was drugs. It was everything. I was so fucked up. So so fucked up. I didn't even catch what was going around. The shade between Katrina and Erica. But well, how did y'all stop fighting? Who hit who first? Erica <coughs> snuck me. Attack me from behind. Mm -hmm. And there really wasn't... people. A lot of people say there really was this tearing it down. There really wasn't a tearing it down. She snuck me. I, You know what I'm saying? Got my shit together and attacked her back. And I was thrown out of the club without e any of my stuff either. So I couldn't come back in the club. They and throw they your cash? It. No, no. Oh, okay, that's your cash. No. Wow. But uh, to this day, are you and Erica girlfriends now? Erica is my gay wife. Gay wife. <laughs> like well, my femme queen. You know what? Wife. I was in Boston with Erica. This is Katrina now hitting me up. Hi, Trina. Now, speaking <laughs> of... Um, speaking of... And my sister. We got the same gay mother. Speaking too. of gay wife and stuff like that, I know a lot of Philly <laughs> girls do that. Do you really, 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 really... Like, like girls? Like, would you date another femme queen? Uh -huh. You want to date a femme queen? No. 
Uh, Erica's as close as it like gets. Like it's a key. It's like. Do you see her performance? Of course. Don't say because that's your girl. You could live for her person personally, but do you live for her Vogue? Like Vogue game, why? Anybody, it's a difference between Butch Queen Vogue Femme and breaking it down. My category is called Femme Queen Performer. So any bitch that can perform and get the audience to go off and have the elements, I live for it. And as we see, especially in Philadelphia, when Erica hit the floor, she can... Definitely make any crowd go the fuck off. And yeah, I, I shout out to Erica. I love Erica. Yeah, shout out to Erica. Now, feminine, you're Miss Raw Hemi. I'm not really supposed to talk about your house. <laughs> Who does this go to? You know, but I'm going to go there because I'm just me. Am I like, I'm And a... I can't be nothing but me. So, how did this Miss Raw Hemi happen? How did this whole happen? Like, how did you become a Miss? Like, who bought you the house? Did you have a sponsor to get in? Or is that, the, do they even, like, see? Um, oh, are you a Miss I am a Miss Raw Hemi. Yes, I am. It is. A lot of things to Kelly and Jack. Kelly and Jack both saw it. Yeah, and okay. Jack really did. And it was like a joke. Somebody spread a rumor about me saying that I was a Mizrahi before when I even that wasn't even. Now, for I'm but. gonna be completely honest with you. Are you gonna stay here? <laughs> Why you ask me that? Because you so you house top so much to con and the you know all these houses. So it's just like oh speaking of con, shout out to Cage. I had reported the story a couple of days back that he was a double seven, he left the house to Mukulia and he is now over with all the con LA. Work Cage. And I mean Cage know each other personally. So shout out to Cage, con now. Yeah. Alright. What happened to Con though? You was a con, what happened? That's because I was at Ebony and at that point I was really still at Ebony. I was trying to do my own thing and explore other options, but at heart, at that time, I still was happening. You still was happening. Mm-hmm. Okay, now let's go into. I want to still go into um a little bit about uh, your arrest. You and Katrina Ebony. I don't know if she was at Ebony at the time, but <laughs> y'all had had a fight with somebody in I don't know what state, but it was a big arrest. y'all beat somebody named Jamal up. <laughs> Fair enough, you tear it, huh? I mean, I grew up in Philly in DC. I had to. Okay, so is it true you and that child both y'all really beat this child up to the point where his head was busted open? You and Katrina Everdeen? Is it kind for me to say yeah? <laughs> I mean, you gotta, you gotta, of you course. have to. You have to handle yourself. Yeah, you really have to, especially in this scene. It's very, very crazy. Like I said, I have to going back to so that. I don't know. Going back to that incident with Erica and all them that just taught me a whole lot because I was totally not paying attention to my surroundings and not being. The person that I am right now. Right. Now, speaking of Femme Queen performance, how long you been moaning for and what do you want to become as a Femme Queen? Um, just more of a girl. I don't really have no goal. Like, I'm just being myself. So, as I grow and different things grow about, like, I love who I am, regardless of how anything. But as I grow, it's different things that I like and I look at the women who I admire and I want Who do you admire um, in the scene? Yolanda. Oh, Mercedes Ebony just had a fight recently. I'm reporting the story now. Mercedes, Who won? I don't know. I really don't even know. I'm sorry to say. Mm-hmm. Mercedes is actually going to come on the show and speak about everything. But anyway, Mercedes. go back to you. Do you like a mm-hmm. performance? Mm-hmm. Speaking of Mercedes. Like like performance? Mercedes performance. Katrina Down. Ebony performance? Down. Veronica Milan? Down. Erica can't you what you say, yeah. Tia LaCroix? It's cute. It's cute. It's, a lot of people it's, it's stick really, to, really, really cute. That's why a lot of people say she's sick to realness. So I had two girls <coughs> say that. Katrina said that and Asia Blintiago said that. What do you think? That she's a sick to realness. Um, Tia is an all-around type of bitch. Type of that's girl. my girlfriend. I think that her realness does overshadow her performance. I do think that. And I think she's sexy. What about the prodigy girl, Shadir and Tef? Tiffany's one of my best friends also. Shadir is a sister. She got to step her shit up now that she's back home because she's not being Shadira. She got to be Shadira with that I. You know. That I know. Vanity Prodigy. Vanity? I don't give my life off of Vanity. I don't see much of her. But she's really, really cunty and... Jasmine Icon? She's nice. Tamaya, Laura. She's cunt and popular. And popular. Mm-hmm. <laughs> A lot of people say femme queens don't see her. What did you say? I know her team is full of witch queens, they say. You know, I got the story. <laughs> She's, um, she gives me like that she's the kind of girl that a lot of film queens wouldn't be around and that the butch queens would draw more to. Well, what film queens wouldn't like? Because she's catty. She is. She's very catty. You got experience before with her, for her to be catty? <laughs> the blind. 
Alright, we're gonna come back more with my lovely sister, Miss Feminine Destruction, Miss Rahi.